Hi guys, it's me, Kat. This is Sandy. Are you? How is everybody doing? You doing okay? Well, that's good. I hope it's I hope it's going better. If you had a bad week or something. Um, anyway, I have a little bit of a decode on Phil Godlewski, and you know I've done another one on him uh, before, and if you've seen it, you're gonna know what I'm talking about, but you'll know the answer <laughs> to who he is. But this is fun. It's fun anyway. So he, he was on live and it was a, a few weeks ago. Uh, sorry, I, I didn't get to it sooner, but it was 9-23. And he said, freaking people out. Okay, in simple gematria, which is Bible coding, if you're new, and it's A equals 1 through Z equals 26, and I use gematrix.org, and I also keep track of some of these in the database on WhatsApp, uh, not as much as I should, but, uh, you know, it works, what I'm doing works, and then you enter it into the gematrix.org, and you see what... God, the Holy Spirit, or whoever you think is helping you, um, angels, you know, whatever, and you'll you'll see what you're supposed to see. You're, you're going to get out of all these different choices what makes sense to you and what you're supposed to write down or put in your computer, or your phone, and keep track of. And after a while, you'll start to see storylines coming through. There'll be a story. And it'll go in different directions, but, um, you know, stuff about President Trump, um, what's happening with him, uh, who Phil is, you know, and th just things like that. It's, it's really fun. So, okay. So, Phil Godlewski, he said, freaking people out, and it equals in simple gematria 196, and it equals thankful I am Jennifer. And Jennifer Mack is played by, uh, as far as I can tell, usually Diana, and I think once in a while by Jackie. And he said, having too much fun on Locals, you know, the channel that you can join and subscribe to. Um, okay. And he said, be on the look, but he switched it. He did like a Trumpology or a Trumpism. And be on the look instead of saying, well, he did, he switched it to a uh, lookout. But be on the look equals Jewish Dematria 340, and it equals IMAX, like you're watching a movie, born to die, because the witnesses are going to die with the beast event from Revelation 11. And then that makes up for the bad stuff they did in the Garden of Eden. And that will make up for um, Jesus not dying on the cross because they got him down before he died. And I think there were others that were supposed to be on crosses. So I think it was maybe four of them were supposed to be there. So they're in big trouble. And God wasn't happy. And, uh, you know, so if Jesus didn't die, then the sins aren't replaced. And that means... Uh, sins of the fathers continue, and that's partly what's you know causing us all the grief that we've been having physically and all that. You know, so once this beast event happens, things get a lot better. So I'm looking forward to it, even though they die, but they come back. Right? It's three and a half days; they're gone, then they come back, and I forgave them for what they've done in the past. So I hope you do too. Once you realize what's going on. Okay, so uh, be on the look in simple gematria is 122, and it equals JFKJR lives, and it equals king and queen, so two, male and female. It equals Fleetwood Mac. Now, I haven't worked on Fleetwood Mac yet. Um, I know Christine McVie is supposedly is gone, but I wouldn't be surprised if they were in Fleetwood Mac and usually... And, Usually what happens is if, if it's a 
you know, a woman singer or an actress, they're playing a man, you, you know, I mean, a man is playing the woman and vice versa. So, you know, Christine McVie could have been junior for all I know, or President Kennedy. Um, yeah, I, like I said, I haven't worked on coding on that. I'm just kind of guessing, especially where Fleetwood Mac came up on his, his Trumpism, Trumpology, you know, be on the look. He said, a hell of a week of shows. Um, hell of a week equals 125 John Kennedy and superhero. And in Hebrew, Jew, Jewish, Gematria, it's 1874 equals two lives. And there's a reason for that. We keep coming up with, you know, king and queen. And now we got two lives. Um, yeah. So here we go again. Um, he said documents so many times. He was talking about documents that are out on the internet and he was saying that, he, I think what the point was, he was saying that they were true, um, these documents, so that's why he said that so many times. Um, in, in Jewish Gematria, it's 522. It's daughter of God, the Red Queen, and Diana was, a, you know, looked at as the queen of our hearts. Um, in simple gematria, it's first lady, and with simple gematria is 114, excuse me, and it's JFK, and then junior spelled out. So we have references to junior and Diana in here, which is typical, you know. They do a lot of things together undercover. Um, let's see. Then he said, noticing something weird happening, and... I don't even know which part I worked on. I think it was something weird happening is the phrase that I did. And it was 114 and it's the same as that I had just done um, just a second ago. And it was simple Gematria 114, First Lady and JFK Jr. So kind of like a double um, confirmation. And he said, some do have proof and Jewish Gematria, it's 1189, and it equals Donald J. Trump. Um, let's see, and in simple, it's 177, the true creator, and it equals the alien invasion, which I'm waiting for. It should be quite a movie. It should be just like War of the Worlds from, what, 1930, 1938 or sooner, I can't remember, with or uh, with H.G. Uh, Wells, H.G. Wells wrote it. Um, it's super good. So if you can listen to the original recording, it's only an hour long. You should. It, you'll get some idea of where we're going with this alien invasion movie that we'll see. Um, let's see. Uh, holy shit! He said it was Jewish. Six eighty five. It equals Jen. So every time anybody says that, they're saying Jen, J-E-N-N. -N. Isn't that cool? So Jennifer Mack. Hi, Jennifer. <laughs> Who's usually Diana. Hi, Diana. <laughs> um, and it equals simple 116. In, uh, you are safe. And I think, I don't even know which one it matches. Uh, is it Jewish? I think it matches. Uh, impersonators. Plural. So, what we have here is Diana and John playing Phil Godlewski. It's just like what I got before when I did that other original video about Phil. Um, most of it wasn't what he was saying. It was just using his name and everything and coding it. Uh, let's see, he mentioned a $21 trillion gift to pay off the debt, a gift to President Trump. That was supposedly what these documents were about. Um, he said, give up. That's Jewish to, I'm sorry, 981. And it equals uh, war, a really painful death. Um, let's see, simple, it's 80. And it's Spencer for Diana Francis Spencer, um, offering and the beast. Now the beast, they're all going to meet the beast, a bunch of them. Until I get other comments that tell me completely the opposite. But 
for now, that's what I got. Um, focus on this particular set of intel. Intel. Particular set of intel in Jewish gematria is 979. It equals junior. You know, I don't know that when I pick phrases out. I, I, I don't know what they're going to match. I, I'm not quick with the numbers, like adding them up and subtract, you know, adding them all up and, you know, I mean, I could if I tried, but I don't. So <laughs> anyway, um, particular set of intel is junior. Um, and then he said, with this particular event in Jewish, it's 140, 1404, particular event. And in simple, it's two families rise, like the Kennedys, the Bissets, or maybe it's the Trump and the Trumps and the Kennedys. Um, yeah, Bissets is a made up name because Carolyn has never been a real person. And, um, you know, Diana has always played uh, Carolyn. And all she had to do is tip her chin differently. When she was Diana, she always had her chin tipped down in a kind of a demure look. And her hair, of course, was different. But when she was Carolyn, either she was wearing a wig or I don't know what, but they put con color contacts in. Probably for Carolyn, but they could put the bright blue colored ones in for Diana. I, you know, just color contacts would change their eyes. And and when um, Carolyn was being photographed, she always had her chin up. She always had like this. Her neck looked nice and long and elegant. And Diana always had was always like this. And they look different, but their noses are the same. Um, yeah. And with all these people changing personalities and doing different things and acting like others, it's really not hard to believe that Diana was always Carol. And is it? Um, she also played Melania. Jackie and and uh, Diana took turns playing Melania. Now, if you saw the the high high spiky heels, it was Jackie playing Melania. And if you saw the low shoes, like almost flats or close to flats, that was Diana because she's taller. Um, okay, I said two families rise, it equals Donald John Trump. Um, he said 21 T live. He said, tw okay, 21 is simple 141, it's reincarnation. It's me, Mrs. Handy, are you? <laughs> and here's Johnny. And it's simple, it's 68, Jenny. So we have all the names in here. Um, Let's see, he switched to, um, he, he was going to say uh, federal drop box, but at first he said federal res, like reserve, R-E-S. And federal R-E-S and is in Jewish 296, and it equals April Fool, imagination, like it's all pretend. Um, and in simple, it's 93, atomic bomb, and... He said OMS several times. Maybe that's a, an acronym that he says a lot, and I just don't know what it is. Um, anyway, uh, it, he said it several times. In Jewish, it's 170. It equals planned. SR, like senior, like John Kennedy senior. Um, ignite. And simple, it's John, Diane, DEFCON, Wi-Fi, and finale. So anyway, I'm hearing kids coming to the door trick-or-treating. I hope they don't ring the bell. <laughs> we have a, a day early here. So we've got wish again. It equals simple 90 and it equals hidden codes. Be prepared. Arrested. I am a twin and sister. So and then we have um, Let's see. I, I, I think I got distracted by the kids coming to the door. Let me start that part again. I'm really sorry. <laughs> There's candy outside in a big bowl. Um, simple. It's OMS is 47. It's John, Diane, DEFCON, Wi-Fi, and Finale. Wish again, like instead of Michigan. Um, simple 90. Hidden codes. Be prepared arrested and they'll all get arrested like 
it, and I think it's going to be President Trump that's doing it, and they'll be on a ship, and then that beast comes up, and then he chows them down, probably digests them and spits out the bones. I don't know. It's going to be gross. But I'll, I'll be on TV. We'll see everything. It's really awful. Um, I am a twin and sister matches, and wish again in Jewish is 1064, and it equals O positive for blood. Um, so that's that for Phil. So I'm pretty sure uh, Phil is, you know, I'm, I'm well, like 100% sure, but I mean, I, maybe I should say 98 just in case, but um, <laughs> it's, it's John Jr., or I call him John Joe Jr., because he used to be Joseph Kennedy, and then he was reincarnated into JFK JR, um, and, and Diana. So I think they're taking taking turns. That we, and tonight, for this one, I'm pretty, even though I got Junior a lot, I'm pretty sure that um, it was Diana at the time. Or maybe they cut the scene and they took turns and they were both there that night. I don't know. But I, I only did about half of it and I, I didn't do all of it because it gets a little repetitive because it starts saying the same thing over and over in decoding. So that's why I only did half of it. But you should do that. You should try you know, decoding things, like what people say. You can even decode what each other says and see what the other meanings are. Um, you can decode President Trump and Juan and um, things that are written, um, you know, like maybe a Truth Social post or a Twitter post or X, whatever it's called. Um, and, and just, you could either use a phrase that's highlighted or a word that's got quote quotations or all the capitals in a paragraph and enter, enter them in matrix.org and um, see what you come up with. Um, it's, it's really fun and I think, I know the White House would like it if more of us did it because that was in, in a Q post, you know. Um, remember that long Q post? It was kind of in the beginning and um, it, it was signed 41020 and it started with my fellow Americans, I'm pretty sure, but I might be wrong. And it signed 4, 10, 20. And that's DJT in Gematria. So that was a sign that they wanted us to do this stuff. You know, this coding stuff and decoding. Um, so, anyway. So what number am I on? I'm on number 4. Um, okay, next. I've got a, a couple of other interesting things to go along with that. Um, so, yeah, this was so interesting. So, Field McConnell, remember Field from his, his show? Um, and that's where I first saw Juan. I, I mean, heard Juan and everything. Um, I know Juan was on for years and years that I, I didn't hear of him. He used to call his W um, on Rogue News, uh, which is still around. And he did that for, as he said, over 16 years, which means he did it for 17 years, you know. And uh, he, in the beginning, W was like a nerdy, sciencey guy. He, you could almost imagine tape on his glasses. <laughs> um, and I'm sure it was always Diana. I'm, I'm sure. Okay, so Phil McConnell. Um, so he was on this ALGN radio and with a woman. And um, I didn't even try to figure out her name. Like, what was her name on the show? I should have done that. Um, but he was definitely a female, and I think he was Diana. Um, so ALGN radio, which is the name of the channel where you can hear him. It's in Jewish, it's 212, and it equals monarch which gives you a reference back to, you know, she was a princess um, over in, in England. Rebrand, like becoming another person. Disembodied, like became another body. And then simple is 81 and it's Jennifer. So that's really why I realized that Field was uh, played by um, Diana. Um, let's see. So I didn't de I didn't decode the whole show. I, that was just something I got. Oh, and ALGN on its own 
is Jewish 68 and it equals a female and ID hid and in simple a L G N equals boob. Isn't that funny? <laughs> They're so funny, these guys. You guys crack me up. Um, <laughs> so I, I had some Aldi's bags, you know. Um, yeah, you know, when you go shopping, you have to bring your own bags. So I had the, you know, the, the plasticky kind of big bags you can buy from them. And I noticed that they looked a little different this last time I bought them. And it said aldis.us and it made me think of a few different things um, us all dies okay like it looks like that everyone in the u.s pretty much is gone from this attack you know whatever it is nuclear chemical whatever looks like everybody's gone and everybody sits around in their own house going oh my gosh am i the only one left you know me and my family um, yeah, that's interesting. So aldis.us, um, and you could also look at it as all, like it of, in parentheses, us, dies, like all of us. Um, and let's see. Yeah, and, and plural for the dies could be the four witnesses that I was just talking about in Revelation 11 with the beast and everything. Um, could be that that's why it says us all die. I mean, it's not proper English, but it usually isn't in Demetria. Um, it's also a reference in Aldi's, the name Aldi's, because the, uh, Princess Diana, her nickname was Lady Di, D-I. <coughs> so... All these, all these, A L D I S. Um, all these dot U S. <coughs> Jewish Demetria is four thirty four. It equals Great Britain. Back to Diana again. Feminine Christ plural. The singers, pointers like the pointer sisters, breast and arm, as Juan he she puts her hands in these long rubbery sleeves like a glove and that's what you see with Juan you know with the it doesn't quite look right with his hands and the wrinkles and everything so yeah it's the gloves breast and arm um, bioplastics isn't that funny bioplastics that's maybe that's what they call the fancy stuff they use to make the Hollywood style costumes that they that they use um, and and all these U.S. that was Jewish, um, and simple. It's ninety-seven, and it's Jacqueline for Jackie, Carrie Ann Lake, and both the ladies Diana and Jackie play Carrie Ann Lake. So that's really cool. Uh, Carrie Ann Lake is um, she's supposed to be, have been a news broadcaster in Phoenix, and she's running for the Senate now. She lost in a fixed election for governor. And she's running for Senate. But I think what's going to happen with Carrie Lake is she's going to run as VP uh, with President Trump. That's what I think is going to happen with Carrie Lake. Um, and I've done a decode on her, too. And, and she's the two ladies, and it's very obvious and all that stuff. Um, a lot of times she's Jacqueline, though, because when you look at her fingers... She has the same fingers as Jackie, very delicate and thin, and they curve. Her fingers curve the same way. Um, so look at pictures of Jackie's hands, and look at um, Carrie Lake's hands. Uh, okay, Jacqueline. Oh, it. Um, so ninety-seven for Aldi's Aldi dot us. Besides Carrie Ann Lake and Jacqueline, it equals Kennedy's. Lockdown, um, they'll be all locked up when they're meeting the beast. They'll be up chains and horrible things. Um, the death card, mistakes, because they made big mistakes in the Garden of Eden and at the cross. Um, cannibalism, and that's what happened in the Garden of Eden because they were following Satan, first Eve and then both, Adam and Eve. And 
the uh, forbidden fruit, what the tree of uh, and the tree was um, human DNA. And the human DNA, when you look at it, has lines on it. You kind of look at it like a tree. So that's the, um, that was what was forbidden, and that's what they did. Because if you follow Satan, devil, Lucifer, as one calls them, um, that's who you follow. You follow that creature, and, you know, that's what he did. So if you're following him, that's what they did. Um. Okay, Poisoned Masculine Movie and Donald John. Um, let's see, what is this? I don't know if I want to get into that. Um, oh, this is cool. Duluth Trading Company is a, a neat catalog. Um, it's for clothes for people who have to work really hard outside. Um, and if you need something that's a little taller, like a lot taller t-shirt or a shirt, it, it they have it like that. And I love it. They're, they're very comfortable and I'm tall. Um, anyway, look at this cover of Duluth Trading Company. See? And it's, I know, doesn't it, when you first saw it, did you think submarine? Because that's what I saw at first. But you see the, the smoke coming out the back. What it is, is an old-fashioned boat that went across the Great Lakes. And it was a steamboat. So even though it looked like a torpedo or a, a sub, it really was a steamboat on the, on the top. And they called it Whaleback because of the shape of it. And anyway, everything is coded all the way down to this on the catalog. I mean, I find it in magazines all the time. All the time. And I'll start marking up the magazines and writing notes, you know. Um, but Whaleback Steamer is on the cover. And Whaleback in Jewish is 950. And it equals Kid by the Side of the Road, uh, Juan's magazine. And Jack-O-Lantern. So I've been getting all these things about Halloween. By the time you see this, it will be long past Halloween. But at least uh, in our calendar, the... Gregorian calendar that we're under now, but in the Julian calendar, the Halloween would be uh, Halloween would be eleven thirteen, and so Jack, you know, possibly something happens then eleven thirteen Halloween, or maybe it's a year from now. Like I thought something was going to happen last year with the World Series with the earthquake, but. You know, I'm taping a whole bunch of these at once. So if there was an earthquake, I'm really excited because it would have been a fake one and I don't think anybody would have died because the White Hats would be doing it and it would just scare people. But, um, or they'd make it look like some died. They'd have this footage to show you of, oh, everybody's, you know, dramatic and all covered in blood and everything. And that wouldn't be real. Um, let's see. So whale back, I was doing that. It's jack, so jack o lantern, um, and way back and simple is new era, planned, lost, freedom event. So it's interesting because we've got jack jack o lantern and the Jewish, and then we've got event and simple, um, scary and marker. Now marker, that's a cute word, and that means it's not going to happen now. It's going to happen in the future. Like, it's a marker to look at something ahead. So maybe it is in a year. Um, lunar and Corona and Twin. And, you know, I keep waiting for the uh, solar eclipse that has the Corona around it, uh, the, the full solar eclipse. And I think it's going to last a long time, probably days. And it'll be dark. It'll be kind of like twilight all the time. And that's probably why there was the books called Twilight, the series, and then the movies, because it will look tw like Twilight, because there'll be just enough light to see. And I wonder if that's when the Beast event will happen, because supposedly it's supposed to be just light enough so that you can see what's going on on TV. Um, anyway, so that's that. Um, it's my whale back. <laughs> 
And I cut the end. This is about the uh, Israeli Gaza. I don't know if they're calling it a war yet, but it's all pretend. Believe me. Um, even if, if the footage looks scary and people look like they're being carted off on stretchers and, uh, you know, it's not real. Um, but it's going to start, like, probably be the thing that starts WW3, you know. And, um, it, you know, everybody will be all divided up and maybe we'll have a civil war during it. And who knows? It's going to be quite, quite something. <laughs> So I caught the end of a live press conference with Israeli IDF, um, Israeli defense um, spokesman. His name's Jonathan, of course. And he said Mario three times. Well, Mario is simple Dramatria, and it's 56, and it's Oscar and Emmy. So the whole little press conference was fake. Um, oh, he, says, he said open the gates. And that was simple 56, and it equals alert and USMC. Like, that's probably who's all behind all this. Um, uh, let's see, what else can I tell you? So, for some reason, because of all the rocket firing and all that, because I was watching Agenda Free TV, which is a good live stream to watch. He's on all the time, and he's just one guy doing this, and he covers it for hours at a time, but also other news. And you can talk to each other and talk to him and send him messages and he'll talk about, you know, in great detail what's going on. But the funny thing is they're all fake and he doesn't know it. So I, I don't talk because I can't stay quiet about it, you know. I'll just watch and see what, they, I just want to see what other people are thinking and see what their point of view is and then I watch something else. Um... But anyway, uh, so I thought I'd try Rocket's Red Glare because, like I said, the rockets are flying and, the, you know, the uh, Iron Dome is trying to knock most of them down. Some of them look like they make it, you know. Um, but Rocket's Red Glare from the Star Spangled Banner, um, I don't think it's a coincidence. It equals, in simple gematria, it's 56, just like I just did with Mario. I mean, everything seems to go along and work together, you know, when you work on things. And so they're both 56. So when he said Mario, it's 56 Oscar and Emmy. And Rocket's Red Glare is 56 Oscar and Emmy. So, yeah, it's so funny. Um, so I took a couple of things about this war, ongoing war between um, Israel, Gaza, or Gaza, Israel, depending on which way you want to say it. Um, so Israel wages growing campaign in Gaza from a Reuters article, and communications blackout eases. And I, I look at authors of, I don't just, add, I mean, you can work on the titles of an article, the, the words in the article, if they're in quotes, you know, if they're highlighted or underlined, that's important. But anyway, you can also look, work on the author of the article. And this one is by Emily Rose and Nidal al Magrabi. And I'm sure I didn't say that right. Emily Rose, in Jewish, is 689. It equals, it's all bull, S-H-I-T. That's what her name equals. Equals sky event, which is exactly what's going on. All these things going back and forth and little streaks in the sky. Warriors and top secret. That's what Emily Rose equals. Nadal, his first name in Jewish is 74. And um, it equals filmed. And in simple, it equals 40. equals IMQ, who's like behind all this, right? I'm not saying that this he is the one that wrote it, but he could have been. Liar and film. So we had filmed in Jewish, and we have film and simple. So it's all filmed. Nadal al Magrabi uh, in Jewish is 432 Princess Diana, and in simple it's 132 um, Princess Diana. So they both are the same thing. They have to be different numbers because Jewish is higher numbers, but they both are Nadal al Magrabi. 
um, no coincidences matches. And let's see. Um, what else? And simple, his name equals predictions. And it, this is fulfilling revelation of John um, wars and rumors of war, right? Like that we had one in um, Iraq and that was like a real one, even though a lot of it was faked out. But, you know, people did die, of course, and stuff. But and now we have a rumor of wars, you know, movie. Okay, another matches to his name movies dvds like all that together matches and in jewish 432 it's uh, america fallen in the end and that's what's going to happen it's going to look like america gives gives up as i've been saying for like three years um let's see telephone and internet communication were partially restored in gaza Partially restored is 218, and it's John F. Kennedy Jr. spelled out. Like I said, I don't know that these are going to match. That's things like that. Um, it matches a dark night, but like a night in shining arbor with a K, to remember the stock market crash. And then in Gaza, in Jewish, it's 558 equals trump card, phony, darkness is coming, and in simple, it's 58 XRP it equals phone, like the phone's out. XRP is a crypto. Um, the Washington Post um, had um, Israeli Gaza war live updates. So Netanyahu warns of long and difficult war. And as internet is partially restored in Gaza, but long and difficult war was in quotes. Quote, in an article uh, was also second stage. So long and difficult is uh, simple 157, the stage is set, death by numbers, and in Jewish it's 519 and it's catastrophic dead. I am the beginning and the end. Remember Q said, saving Israel for last, a very special reason not mentioned before. Um, second stage is Jewish 395, and it equals Operation End of October. London has fallen. Three bridges, because it will probably look like bridges have collapsed. California Dreaming, um, Call to Arms, A Bridge Too Far. So that was all Jewish. Second stage and simple is 112, and it's Scare Event. Remember, Q said, scare event necessary and showtime alive, not dead. So President Trump, it may, it's going to look like he's gone, but he won't be. Israel Communications Minister Shlomo Kari, Kar Karhi used all means at its disposal, that was highlighted, to fight Elon Musk's, and this is highlighted, promised effort to provide Starlink support to internationally recognized organizations in Gaza. So let's see how much of this I got. I don't know. Uh, Shlomo, the guy's name, in Jewish it's 248, it equals rocket conflict. And in simple 82, it's Armageddon, strike and backwards. Like what he says is the opposite. Karhi is Jewish 108 DEFCON and it's simple it's 47 it's John and radio um, at its disposal Jewish 624 Mary Magdalene so she, there, she's signing it too and, um, there was two Marys there was uh, Diana and Jackie um, let's see the army so I'm still on Jewish at its disposal, the army, explosion, League of Nations, like like World War III, um, economic collapse of America, and simple, the gloves are off, like Diana or Jackie, I think Jackie plays Juan sometimes, but it's usually Diana, taking off those long rubber gloves that were Juan's. Um, the gloves are off, winner takes all, Nothing wrong and promised effort 
is Jewish 575, and it equals emergency, not true, and simple, it's 169. The stock market, the time is coming, cut any ties. And it also equals Vincent Fusca, which means conquering darkness. And I have my picture taken with one of them. And I keep thinking now, um, it wasn't John Denver. I think it was Jackie, my Vincent Fusca. So we'll have to try to figure that out, right? I met, I took a picture with my Vincent Fusca, as I say, in D.C., in uh, Trump, Trump D.C., um, before he's sold it. Now, I don't know if he really sold it, but supposedly he sold it. Um, Vincent Fusca, mind control, beginning the end. And I'm like, let's hope. Um, let's see. Um, and then they mentioned, so promised effort. This is something that Shlomo had been saying. So he said promised effort and with Starlink. And let's see, with Starlink equals simple 164. The gloves are off again. The kingdom crashed, winner takes all, all of that all over again. So it's a double confirmation. Um, and it also equals Charlottenburg, which is a famous, um, huge castle over in Germany. I don't think it's Austria. I think it's Germany. And I happen, happen to have bought, um, it's like, well, it's not an etching. What is it called when you press a plate? An engraving of Charlottenburg that's hand watercolored. And um, anyway, so I have I had that for quite a while and I did a research about Char Charlottenburg and I think Diana was uh, Queen Charlotte. That's what it's named after way back then. Um, but first I thought it was Melania, but now I realize there's no Melania ever that it was the ladies we talk about playing Melania, you know, Diane and Jackie. Um, yeah, so anyway, that's that. I think I've gotten through. Oh, and there's something about Thanksgiving. There's so many piles of papers. Um, so I thought this was interesting because we're coming up on Thanksgiving, and I was talking to a friend, uh, Charmaine. Hi, Charmaine. I don't know if she's watching all these, but we were talking about turkey, having turkeys is like a mass sacrifice all at the same time. Because, you, you know, you go by turkey farms and all that, and then suddenly they're gone or, you know, everybody's getting turkey. Some people get ham, and I, I know not everybody, but um, a lot of people, millions of people at least, get turkeys. In the United States and so when you think about it they're all being killed at about the same time packaged up and shipped to stores and that's like a blood sacrifice I mean remember we talked about um, abortion was a blood sacrifice so every time there was an abortion it was a sacrifice and that they could get the loose and the, and the bad feelings from it and all the badness the sadness and all that and they, they love that the bad guys the cabal the um, but anyway, so I just tried, I just thought I'd try No Thanksgiving, and it came up with hidden knowledge and mind-blowing, so I thought that was good. Turkey sacrifice in simple is 173, and it equals the shelves are bare, third world war, a night to remember, so I thought that was a tough one, you know, to hear. Um, who, I don't know when it's going to happen, but it could be coming up. Um, and it, that was in Jewish. So no Thanksgiving and simple is 170 equals World War III. Um, financial crash now and mind blowing. So I, I feel like we've gotten that a couple of times. So we've got double confirmations on that again. Um, yeah. And in 2022, it was November 17th, no, I'm sorry, 7th, um, which you can look at, you know, drop a 1 from the 11 and go to 7, and that's like a 17 for Q. Um, and President Trump, in this little short video clip, said at an Ohio rally, I think it was a shorts clip on YouTube, 
He said, forget about buying a turkey for Thanksgiving. So at some point, we're not even going to be doing turkeys. Like, I, you know, there's a whole bunch of stuff I'm pretty sure we're not going to be doing anymore. So it's going to be hard to get used to, but maybe when our um, DNA shifts and gets better and all of it's working, it won't bother us at, at all. You know, like, it'll just be, yep, yeah, let's do that. Let's not have that. It's not good for us, or we don't want to be part of a sacrificial whatever. And I'm not expecting you guys to listen to me. This is just all new, and, you know, it, I don't expect anybody to listen to me. <laughs> I'm just telling you what I figured out, what I think I'm getting. So, anyway, I love you guys. I hope you liked that. It was a little scattered, but... um I hope you got something out of it. Maybe you can learn how to look for, you know, false stuff or double talk as President Trump does. You know, when he double talks, he repeats things. Phil does the same thing. Juan does it. Um, repeats a phrase. Work on that phrase in Jimatrix and see what you get. And if anybody gets anything good, write them in the comments. Even if it's a lot later, just write them in the comments and... Uh, I love you guys. Thanks for uh, sharing the video and making all your lovely comments. I do love you. Bye.